Hey everyone, this is Liam here, and this week we are going to be talking about male and females viewed in society from my perspective. <laughs> I think that made sense what I said. Basically, I'm going to be talking about how I've been viewed differently um, being seen as uh, identifying as male versus when I um, presented more as female. First off, I think the, the most apparent thing that I've kind of seen is that as a male, I can kind of see more of how there is a male privilege um, when people see me, uh, specifically when men say I'm going to a store or whatever if I'm looking for something and the person working there is a man and I ask a question, they are more, um, usually more prone to kind of giving me the straight up answer, not messing around, probably give me some tips and be a little more buddy buddy. But when I say was presenting as female and would be in the same types of situations, I feel I'm, like I was brushed off a little bit more or kind of like, how do I describe it? not taken seriously or not thought to have taken seriously in regards to certain issues or that I probably didn't know as much as my male counterpart. It's just kind of a little more clear to me how um, women are kind of like set up to essentially take up as little space as possible. They're expected to be a certain way in society and to not be natural. Like as simple as body hair and that sort of thing. You're expected to not have body hair when it's fucking natural to have body hair. You know, it's not like women just stay fucking prepubescent and have no body hair ever. I don't understand why society expects women to replicate children, essentially, but there's these roles that society kind of makes for women, and then men are some, for some reason, allowed to take up more space and to do what they want, and it's kind of passed off as, oh yeah, you know, he's just sowing his wild oats, or, you know... It's just a guy thing, and he can do this because, you know, it's, he's just, he's a man, he's stubborn, he's going to be this way. I just kind of see the unfair advantage men have, and I think it just fuels me more to be a activist for women. And I, you know, I detest gender roles, and I think that that's the reason why I feel like I... Um, identify as a feminist because I would I want to recognize that there is a discrepancy and work towards some sort of equity and equality and anyway I'm gonna wrap it up here that is my views and my take and I hope I brought a little insight and a little entertainment as well Thank you very much for joining me, and have a wonderful night. Bye.